Hello everybody and welcome back. We're coming back for some more Caves of Cud. Same playthrough for me. Two separate videos for you on YouTube, on Twitch. I don't know, nobody's here. It's okay. Uh, what is your name? My name. Uh, my name is Potato Man. I want to say Potato Man Phillips or Potato Man Jenkins. Phillips. Potato Man Phillips. On the fifth of Teba Ooks, you arrive at the Oasis Hamlet of Joppa along with far from Magri, the Great Salt Desert, more more gray. All around you, moisture farmers tend to grow a verdant, verdant water vine. Their hoods rot from rock, salt, and bind stock. On the horizon, cuds jungle strangle chrome sleepless and rust archways to the earth. Further and beyond, the fabled spindle rises above the fray and pierces the cloud ribbon sky. <sighs> God, last time. This upset me horrifically. Horribly so. There's never any chests in here. So I'm pretty sure it's not random. Make sure you close the doors before you steal all these uh, nice people's belongings. Dark armor, good. Something we don't need. Ooh, bandages, nice. Sharp desert, Chris. And we just got someone was just leaving their water money in here. That's right. Could you? Literally drink your currency. What an arrows? Small milky tube is an artifact. Which wood wreath? It's a head thing. Rubber tree seed. I have no idea. Vine wafer clubs. Burt compressors. Water skins. We got a weird artifact for Argive. Iron Battle Axe for Tam. Short bow for Tam. We gotta go into the weird ritual for. I'll oh, do it after we get some more renowned. What are you doing? Blue Cursor. Blue Cursor. What are you trying to tell me? What kind of creature are you? No. We're going over here. We don't need bark armor. Nope. 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 Hi. I want to buy some water vine. I'm going to buy all your water vine. 277. I'll never have to worry about food again. I have this. Um, weird artifact. No, we can't. Not the weird artifact. Other armor. Do that. And bark armor. I could do that. Maybe we shouldn't, though. So, when arrows, you could just have them. You could just have them. No, we'll just decrease our water vines. How do you like them? Trade complete. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Tam. Tam. Got some stuff for you. What, what do you have that looks good to me? Twenty drams of wine? I've never even heard such a thing in this game. Oh, a steel buckler, look at that. Lacquered wooden buckler. Do we have a shield? We don't have a shield in this one. Lacquered wooden buckler, steel buckler. God, no, that would take like every single ounce of trade good we have. Lacquered buckler. 
It's pretty expensive there, buddy. My hand axe, bronze long sword, bronze dagger. And we're wearing. Let's check with see what we're actually wearing first. We are wielding an iron buckler and an iron long sword. Iron long sword is six to hit and one d4 damage. Okay, 1d4 damage. This would do 5 to hit, 1d3. That's worse in every possible sense of the word. Uh, too bad we didn't take any. We might still be able to use a musket without um, stuff in it. I can get this wooden buckler. It is nicer. Oh, mud slugs. Oh, I'd love to. Oh, all you things that I'd love to have. Small rosy tube, vine wafer, torches unburned, bandages. I'll buy bandages. All of them. It's 33 drams. I'm not giving away my artifacts. Fuck you. Nice try. Club, battle axe, sharp desert kiss, and a short bow. Um, Burt capacitors count. I don't think we'd make it anyway. Nope. No, wait, we're trying to get all these bandages. Fuck these bandages. Oh, come back and get them. Let's just, let's just make the deal. And we'll sell this. Four out of five employees surveyed recommend listening. We want to get as much help as we can, because uh, we'll make it very far. Um, there we go. Lacquered wooden buckler. Oh, shit. Damn it, that's why it's so heavy. It's kick ass. God damn it. Alright, we need to sell you something back. I made a poor trade. Damn! I'm sorry. Um, I should probably actually get. You got, like, shit. I don't want anything of yours. We'll get some from Argive. Gotta find such a cave. We got the quest. Finish the quest. Here's your knickknack paddywhack. Here's your milky tube. And if I must, we'll get him another knickknack paddywhack. And this one's not a tube. He leveled up. Alright, now he's gonna send us to get the wire. Fucking music sound. Oh, yeah, because we got a level. Um, 58 does not give you anything. I'll make you go over here and upgrade our flaming hands or get our carapace up. Get our carapace up and we'll make sure we try and get our sleep gas turned on once we leave town. We, we don't care about anybody else. There, I need to see what you got for me. Mud slugs, data discs, vine wafers. Oh. I don't have enough yet. Mm. I thought you'd be able to identify it for me, but I guess you can't. I guess let's take the other quest really quick too. While we're here. Hello, good sir. Can you tell me about Joppa? What? I'm in search of work. Yes, accept quest. 
Oh, we could do the water ritual of this guy, too. Shout away, it's one dram of water. Nope, stop sprinting. Nope, we're sprinting. What are you running for? You share your water with Mehmet, and we get the water ritual. Your reputation with the village of Joppa has changed by a hundred. Because they admire Mehmet, your reputation with Crag Mensch changed by a hundred. Because they dislike Mehmet, your reputation with Grazing Hedonist changed by negative fifty. Live and drink, friend! Live and drink! Would you teach me your ways? Learn harvestry. Um. Damn it, I have enough reputation with the villagers of Joppa. Your reputation with the villagers of Joppa is minus 40%. Or minus 40. Why? Mamet could award you an extra 100. Why doesn't it give me that extra 100 now? Hey. Your thirst is water is mine. Here, I pour you a glass, you give me a glass, we'll cup our arms around each other, and then I'll drink some, you drink some, we get some of that sweet, sweet, delicious, pure spring water. Your reputation with the Fellowship of Wardens changed by a hundred. Because they admire water. Ooh, Rig, your reputation with the villagers chop it changed by a hundred. Share a secret with me, friend. Uh, <gasps> oh, that would be so cool. Hey, how's it going? You're dead. Uh, meditation with the bane of, and uh, meditation with swine. Uh, the village is a Joppa. It's good. Sure, secret with me. Teach me your ways of harvestry. It's seventy-five. We learned harvestry. Oh shit, we bought all that stuff. Man, we just wasted our points on that. Um, I guess we'll do the dance one more time. Rotation with the Fellowship of Wardens is 250. Why can we just keep doing this? Hm, nope. 250. Alright, who else can we do the song and dance to? Nope, not you. Archive. Archive does not seem like the kind of dude to do the water dance with us. We'll try. Nope. He's way too busy in his work. Yeah, I'm clicking all kinds of wrong shit. There is one other person I feel like would possibly do the dance. Someone just flew by me, I don't know what the hell it was. It scared me. Right. Mosquito. Mosquito, no no. What the hell is that? What are the Canticles, chromatic verses, a depiction of an arching, gear-driven machine has been meticulously tooled onto the cover of this chrome-tanned leather Bible of the McKinnon Illuminated, this book is adorned with decorations, marginalia, and illustrations. It's worth 30% more. Boom, bing. the ship. I don't know where that came from. Where is? I don't know what this is. Rest in peace. Oh, it's tombstones. Where is the body of Ormashur Umarum? Burned to death by a luminous moat. Oh, jeez. No, oh, wow. I don't see mine. Drank from poison oil skin. 27 drams of oil. Oh, jeez. Swallowed a small smoky tube. Here rests 
Why? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't he? This is our guy's uh, place for his dead um, apprentices. Fucking madman. The hell? Rest in peace. Shun Kashermet breathe too much sleep gas. Why do you keep going to the glow pad automatically, you son of a bitch? I'm trying to read this. Here lies Yimager, sat on a weird artifact. Oh, I didn't know that was a bad thing. Here rests Nyshirkad, died of metaphysical causes. Steep. Man, we are streaming really well. I am happy I have upgraded my computer. I don't know what happened to what's his face. Alright, we'll take one more quick look around. I don't see him anywhere though. Looking for the six day stilt guy if you haven't uh, figured out. Cat! Cat, you might be able to tell me the secrets. Meow meow! You put Stesifus for. You start to glow. Soft growling. Live and drink. Oh, he's got nothing to trade. The hell? Alright, I still don't see him. Let's check down here. We just might have to leave without uh, doing the water dance with uh, what's his face. Oh, we could try doing a. Uh, I'm gonna do a. Um, no, I just want to harvest. Oh, direction. How about over there? You harvest some fine wafer. Ten of them. Makes you feel like an ass for uh, buying some. All right, we, here we are. We're at Jopa. This is Red Rock, and actually, Red and outcropping of stone juts out of the salted crag. Um, we have to go to both these places. The rusty wells, the red kudzu vines take as their trellises, chrome wells, poured into the earth. Um, I wish I could pronounce things a little better than that. Oh, see that? That's the spire. That's cool. This is a six day still, I'm pretty sure. Let's check up there really quick. Six days stilt. The six days stilt rises from the dunes like a petrified kraken corpse, bearing down upon the vacant flats. Oh, jeez. This is a Bethesda Souza. Beyond shifted stone and tombs, the age angleless ang architecture of Bethesda's lair. Uh, okay. Garden of Geth. Here lies the Garden of Geth, from whose ancient coordinate seeds sprouted in spite of the earth's. Trollness. I don't know how the fuck to say that. Um, tomb of the Eaters. Through a prismatic umbrage fly the archways and buttresses of the monuments above the catacombs of the Eaters of the Earth. What is this? Is that like just a pond or is that... Y Yanth breaks the massive to the strange east and ushers its nameless waters into cud. Fish things feed on her bath salt chips. Basalt chips. Bass. Ba ass. Ass chips. Banana grows. Oh, bananas. Golgotha. Shroud and rotting jungle are the mouths of the rust case of Golgotha. Chrome's graveyard. And this is the Great Great. I've been there before. What is that? Actually, before you move on. Rusted archway. Span the sky rust a metal archway, under which pass the chrome gargantuans, canonized in the elder canticles. I guess we'll go deal with the um, vine eaters. You have finished a step, travel the better. Quest, what's eating the water vine? You received 50. Um, let's look at this weird colored shit up here. 
I know it's a giant amoeba, I just want to move around. Jams of slime. Ew. Alright, we gotta be careful here. Alright, looks like that slime is coming for us. Does it look like it's coming to us? For, uh, to you? Alright, we'll step behind here to get an idea. Oh, uh, yeah. Maybe not. Nope, it's definitely coming for us. Fire the lasers! Oh, it's a flaming piece of shit. Giant amoeba. You single-celled fuck. Leave me alone. Uh-oh. It is... coming down on us hard. Fuck you! Take another fucking flame blast, blast to the face. You're staggering. Alright, we'll hop off into the next place here. I don't know what the hell that... Oh, it's another fucking amoeba. Eat shit! We st stab it with our... Takes one damage from the fire started by you. And it dies. Um, the flaming giant amoeba hits for two damage with its giant pseudopod. 1d3. You hit for one damage with your iron longsword. Yeah, you know, we could do a little better than that. Let's leave here before this other amoeba gets any ideas. I said before this other amoeba gets any ideas. I see you. Bam. Run away! Shwow. Run away again, and he dies. Fill our water skims with slime. Alright, we could look around here. I don't think there'll be much, really. Let's just go down. <clears throat> Back up. Okay, defensive stance. Um, let's emit gas generation. You're getting sleepy. Uh, it's like we gotta fart it out and then run. Sure, there's a setting I wanna put on. I just remembered. Automatically drink fresh water when thirsty. Nearby have to the pools. I just want to highlight. Is there in a face modding performance debug? Tile display. There's base. Show the number of items. Disable floor textures. Always highlight stats. Awesome. Alright, let's try it out. Oh boy. Um, I got a fart. Oh, it's on. It's cooling down. In round cooldown. Damn. How about you guys? Eat shit. Bam. We splattered them across the fucking ground. It's the fireball. Tears them apart. Yeah, right after blowing all apart his friends, we take our sword and cleave him in twain. This other one steps to fight us. The Snapjaw Hunter. Snapjaw Scavenger doesn't penetrate the armor with his bronze dagger. 
he does no damage. Um, wait, he hits for three. Hmm. Well, my sword's gonna fuck you up. Oh, take a big hit. It's okay. Oh shit. Snapjaw scavenger. You need to get out of the way. We need to go up the stairs and heal. Did you follow us up here? That was a mistake. Hello. Flaming Snapjaw Scavenger dies. You gain 10 XP. And we'll just... Oh! Oh! Oh shit! They could climb stairs now! Bam! Hopefully he died. Got an iron dagger, vinewood set mask. I'm gonna pick up the dagger. Um, iron dagger, vinewood set mask. Oh, we'll just get this. What does this even do? I wanna like look at it. Iron mace. I'll take that too. We'll get a pretty penny for that. I'm sure. Bronze mace. We'll leave it. Leather apron, though. Can we wear that? It's just an apron. Um, I should have equipped it while we had it there. B. Equipped auto. Your curse prevents you from equipping this. Um, I'll just drop it then. Um, oh, we should have sold that. Go down. We got a lot of bodies we could loot here. Just got bronze shit. Grave studded leather armor. We'll take that to sell. Six one D six. Six one D six, you say? Six one D six. That bronze sword might be better than ours. Is that a two-hander, though? Might have been a two-hander. Bronze two-handed sword. Nope, I don't want it. I need both my hands for fucking shit up. Stop. Furs lacquered bronze battle axe. Um, hold on. I'm playing peekaboo with a snapjaw over here. And he's gone. Okay. Back to what we're doing. Lacquered bronze battle axe. Yeah. Probably not worth that much. What the hell? See him off in the distance, like burning? <laughs> Bloodstained neck ring. Bronze dagger, iron battle axe. We'll take the iron battle axe too. Um. I will put the neck ring on. It's probably made out of teeth. Bronze dagger, leather moccasins. Yeah. Actually, can we wear leather moccasins? Even if they're leather and bloody? Um, they might not even offer anything, actually. We'll just pretend we didn't see that. Small boulder. Oh, I didn't mean to just run up and attack him, but we did okay. Um, you look like a special one. Are you okay? No, I know I'm Potato Man Phillips. Oh, this is a bloody one. Oh, you're... He just fucking ran into a... Um, a young... something. Bronze Dagger. What is that? Bloody Young Ivory, I was right. Packed into rents in the shale are the spin... Spine Sense. Shoots... She... Damn. Packed in their rents in the shell are the spine scent shoots of blooming ivory. Fucking bone spurts just jut out of the ground. What the hell? Why did you, you pass by bloody bronze dagger, bloody leather moccasins, bloody snapjaw? Why is he. What has happened to you? 
I know what's gonna happen to you. You'll be a flaming. You'll be a burning man. Oh. He just, uh. Man, we can't penetrate him? Oh, shit. He's bleeding out. Three turns, we got three turns. E shit. Bam. Iron short sword. One, six, one, D three. Let's get that. Probably sell it. Quilted shawl. I don't know what this does. Let's look at it. Only multicolored shawl. Sure to distinguish her. Distinguish its wares from the rest of the pack. Hey, um, look this up. I just, these are like the only things I can't remember. Caves of Cud. Um, icons and items. Pressing F1 in the game has lots of info. Not everything, but enough to get started. I don't think that's what we're looking for. Ah! Alpha Beard. Now I forgot your fucking name. For weapons, the arrow is penetration. The heart is damage. If an attack hits at penetration, there it is. Compare the target's AV when the penetration equals this. For armor, the diamond is AV. It's compared to the penetration, the weapon's arrow. The circle is dodge value, which makes you more likely to not be hit by the attack roll at all. So, minus one would be bad. But it's got cold resistance. That'd be good, right? Probably not. We'll take the shawl. It will sell it. All right, we need to decide which way we're gonna go. So we're going right. Hold on, don't move. Yeah. The bloody jilted lover hits for two damage with its thorns. Hey, hit us from there? Fuck you, I'm going around. Uh, it's a bear! Iron short sword, huh. Now it's a flaming fucking bear! The stairs. You could climb upstairs too. Um, defensive stance. Nope. A fire to cloud of gas. Heh heh. Poor dumb bear. Prepare to die to the thoughts of doom. He is. <gasps> Okay, over there. Are these all chasing me? Get out of the way! Gain a level there, level 3. Oh shit. We need to spend our level points. I'm pretty sure we get full health. Oh no, we don't. Oh shit. Um, toughness. Intelligence, ego, willpower, agility, and toughness. We'll increase that one. Yes. Uh, RAV minus 5 DV. Heat resistance, cold resistance, my Twitter carapace. Um, let's check this one. So 9 square radius, 1D4. This is 2D4. This one, yes. 
extra damage. Um, the real question is, are you guys faster than me? They kind of are. What is that? Body horde comedian. Chameleon. You died. We were killed by it. I tried to run away at the last second. This fucking game, man. I spent so long trying to get good shit. Do this, do that. I think I've learned, though, for next time. Don't run away out into the wilderness. You will get killed by many more things than the thing you're running from. So we're trying to run around in circles, I guess, is the only thing I could think of. <sighs> will I remember that for next time? Probably not. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like. Let me know what you want to see more cases cut in the future. Hopefully we'll get a little further. This is pretty fun, I haven't played this in quite a long time. But now I have a shitload of videos to edit. And stuff. I was streaming this on Twitch, so if you would like to see some Caves of Cud live and want to talk to this person, or maybe one of the other fine people also streaming this game, make sure you stop by. And, you know, chat, comment, do some feedback, or just want to say hey, because I will say hey back. Take care.